Uh, this is um, 211. Um, her name's Gina, and she's a four string fiddle. And it's like kind of a different finish this time than my other fiddles. I've been learning a new technique using oil pigments. And so i um, kind of happy with how she looks. It's not as dark as some of the other fiddles, but it has a um, golden kind of base with brown amber, like honey colored highlights on top of it. So it kind of looks like it's lit up inside. And I kind of like it. Here's a little close up of the carvings on the back. And so uh, it's nice flamed maple and all the way through and has dust on it. I'm sorry, shop dust. It's been in my shop while I was making another fiddle. And the top is, of course, Engelman spruce that I like. And um, I guess it has kind of a sh slight antiqued look to it. But not overly antiqued, just kind of real subtle. And the scroll, kind of dusty, sorry for that. And I have prim strings on her. And uh, this fiddle has an interesting tone. It's um, pretty loud um, and still kind of sweet but not quite as dark uh, as some of the other fiddles but not bright either so <laughs> So, excuse my playing, my hand's a little stiff today, so it's not really behaving. Anyway, this is 211, her name is Gina, and uh, I'm happy with it. It turned out really well, it looks real pretty, and it plays nice. All the strings are balanced. It's got pretty powerful, pretty loud fiddle, and um, nice, sweet tone, and um, needs good home. So, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.